I'm at the Pine Valley Pathway. I did a little thing in it last winter. You might want to look at that for more information and location. I wanted to see how it is in the summer, well, spring. I want to see if there's any uh, bicycle usage here. Let's see if the trails are suitable and uh, nice for biking. Um, nobody's been biking out here. The trails aren't that bad. They're a little rough. They have, have been smoothed by usage. So they're pretty rough and raw. But uh, you certainly could bike out here, no problem. But I don't see any evidence of people doing it on any kind of regular basis. Hmm, not sure the sign is right. I think that arrow for four should be pointing to two. I'm going to go that way and see, but I think I came from four, which was behind me. So this isn't making a lot of sense, unless I got turned around. Beautiful little lake. I'm not sure if it's Lost Lake or one of the other lakes that are around here. Well, it's a beautiful area. It does get quite a bit of cross-country trail usage for cross-country skiers. But I haven't seen any trace of uh, any foot traffic or bike traffic. Where it crosses the ORV trails, I haven't seen any, anybody but me as far as leaving tracks behind. Uh, either pedestrian or bicycle. Well, I did the hike down the hill, low part of the hill, and down to the lake here. It's pretty nice. Pretty steep hill on that side. So I don't know if people consider this lake swimmable or not. See a lot of logs in the water and a little bit of algae bloom. Probably not the best place in the world to swim. You'd probably survive. And there's all kinds of trails down and around here. You gotta keep your eyes peeled for the cross country ski badges. Well, second time I came across some logs over the road that I couldn't get around easy. The cigarette butt. Now I'm on the kind of the south loop down back to one. Another little lake down there. There's a little and a big. I forget the name of the lake though. 
I think the last lake I was at was Lost Lake. But these are like round or something, I don't know what they're called. And looking south here in the distance, swamp and a bigger lake. Getting near the roadhead now, taking the southern loop back to number one. You can hear M37 in the background there. Yeah, third place I had trees across the trail. Not too bad. Well, it was empty when I came here, but it's a Friday evening and the ATV people are here. Good thing I got riding when it was pretty relatively quiet back there. The ATV trails uh, surround these trails, they are not the same. ATVs aren't allowed on the foot trails. And there's a big loop that goes north of Seven Mile, which I'd like to explore. Slightly more advanced, although I hear not much. But uh, I'm going to check it out. I'll probably be back here and uh, see what it would be like to cross-country that thing. Preview it. 